All right, uh, so this is how you do like the spin texting. So I already did it with uh, this. But now I'm uh, just gonna show you how to do it with a simple word. So just create your tech clear, right? Hello, right. okay. Then what I like to do, right? Turn on proportional grid here. Um, and then what I do, right? Is you see the anchor point, anchor point, my God. It's not centered, so what I do, right, is I center the anchor point, so it's in the middle of the word. Then I control D, and you could do this with a tool, I think, but I'm not sure how. And what I do is I have to, like, have every letter uh, isolated to, to its own, like, layer, if you get what I mean. So, oh. um, so position here. You're gonna put it at where their letter is, right? So like there's the E Let me add a um, right. So I just want it to be like on top of the thing So here, right? I see it's a little bit Okay, should be alright It doesn't have to be like Exactly exactly the same thing, but you get what I mean um, <clears throat> so here it's all right and then duplicate it again o position okay so now right you have this all of these letters and now you want to animate them so what you, you can do right is i have a little song here start and so there, I, I'm just gonna go to the middle, right? Rotation, keyframe it at the middle. Same everything there. Rotation. For all of the letters. So here, right? I'm gonna do 180 degrees. And at the end, minus 180. And then just go in value graph and like do something like this so it's smooth see like okay you can't really see it with the o what you can do right is you copy paste it and skip a letter and go to this letter and this letter and then see it like it, it rotates only the letters so you can do the same thing here so but instead of 180, I'm going to do minus 180. So take that and do 180 here. And do a similar graph, but the other way. So. Doesn't have to be like exactly this, but you know what I mean. Uh, just add motion blur this and you see like now we can keyframe the position right so keyframe the position in the middle what i like to do right is i like to have my text like go from out to in so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna do this uh, uh, just like generally just move it wherever doesn't matter and then you can copy paste it there. Okay, now that you have this, F9. And with, I also like to like uh, lower my stuff a little bit so it looks clean. And then just a little less. Add in this, I got two. So I'm just gonna redo it because it doesn't have the Then you can go in speed graph right here and just do something like this.
Sí. So like it's decent, you know. But it's still not the effect yet. 